so in the last section we have seen uh, how to create uh, material so this is one example of material that we have given and uh, you can add more material using by clicking this option and this material also displayed in your stream section you see uh, here the material is displaying that means uh, whatever you create here that will be appear here in a descending order you can make it uh, this one as the top or this one as the bottom it depends on you but by default these are uh, in the descending order so that you can track which one you have recently posted so now in this class we will see uh, how to create uh, questions so let's begin with the simple question so when I click on question you see this screen is open so for saving time I've just taken one question from the internet uh, let's say I just paste this question here so this is the question and this question is a sort answer type question we are provided two options that is sort answer and multiple choice so by default, uh, let's say uh, we are uh, making this one as a sort answer. This is an instruction that you can write it here. This is optional. That means suppose if you want to give some extra information about this question, you can uh, write it here. So as this is optional, let it be blank. Now in the right side, you see uh, some options are given. That is and information also that is this question is for class 5a and applicable for all students and this is point so point uh, is not required for the timing because uh, you are making this one as a uh, homework so let's unmark it and this is the due date that means uh, suppose if you have uh, 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 given this homework uh, and that to be completed in few days let's say on 30th or 31st so you can mention that date so as we are practicing now let's make it no due date this topic we will see later not required for the timing and uh, this is the option they have given that means the student can reply to each other that means among the students they can uh, reply their answer or they can discuss a student can edit the answer that means uh, once he has uh, he or she has given the answer so in future she can modify it so let's say make it date so the moment you do anything here by default this is saved in a draft section so to publish this question you have to click on ask so you are provided with three options that is schedule, strike, draft, discard. So this thing we have already seen is uh, when to post this answer, uh, sorry question. By default these are saved in draft format. You can uh, ask this question tomorrow or day after tomorrow, it depends. So these are the options we have already known and uh, we have seen in the previous videos. So let's post this question now. So when I click on ask, the question is posted, you see, this is the question, okay, uh, suppose if you have uh, done any mistake, you can edit this one, and uh, you can add some information, and you can save it again. So this is the question you have created now if you want to see in the stream section by default it appears here at the top you see so that you can have a track that which is the recent post I made so this is the simple question we have created now and in the next section we will see on the next video we will see how to make a bit complex question okay so Thank you very much.